So, as you saw from the uh, nice cinematics that Aaron got, I now own a Metro, or technically a Rover 100. Um, I bought this to replace my daily. Uh, it is just standard at the moment. I'm the second owner. It's got the 1.1 engine with the 5 speed box, and it's, uh, it's only got 20,000 miles on it, but. That's, uh, that engine's coming out, we put in a uh, 1.8 twin cam K series in it and uh, I think we're going to go with the, I think it's the R56 box, that would be 5 speed as well and that should hold the power so it'll have about 180 brake it's getting stripped out, even though it's like immaculate, it's getting stripped out, caged and it's going to be my uh, daily slash fast road slash track toy basically uh, yeah You'll see the from the nice walk rounds the paint's really nice. Has had like a little bit of welding done on the rear arches, but they always rust on the rear arches. But it's ready to go. Literally just need to start ordering parts and you'll see that in the coming videos of just chucking parts on hopefully and making good power. It will be a bit of a sleeper to start with because I'm gonna leave it looking like this. I might lower it a little bit, but it will be looking like this with the 1.8 because that's the first thing I'm going to do is engine swap it, that's the first thing, so it will look like this with a K-swap, K-series. So it might look like a bit of a sleeper for a little bit until I uh, strip it out and cage it, but couple bucket seats, steering wheel, cage, that's all it's going to be. Plain and simple, just thrash it around the road and track and stuff like that basically. Right, I'll now show you the uh, standard engine bay with the 1.1 and I'll show you what we're replacing. going to be because this is the 100 I am going to make it to a mark 3 by because it's a track slash fast road I'm getting a five glass bonnet with the mark 3 which means the grill that goes because the mark 3 bonnet comes down to here I'm getting mark 3 bumpers front and back mark 3 lights and I think I've been told that the Rove 100 front arches they fit with the earlier lights but I'm not too sure so I might have to get arches so I will be getting a fiberglass bonnet with the quick release pins, older bumper. So it will look the front end will look a bit more older than what it does now. I think it looks a bit fucking ugly now. Um, the boot I'm gonna get the standard GTI um, rear spoiler. It goes around the rear window and it's got the spoiler at the top. That's like OEM, but it looks nice. I'm gonna get the GTI on the Mark III bumper, the GTI front splitter, probably body color, and then I'm gonna get the body color. Um, side skirts, the GTI side skirts down the side as well, so it should look more sporty than it does now because it looks a bit granny at the moment. Thank you. 